Right, hello, welcome to my garage. This is uh, where I can get a bit of quiet. Um, uh, I can try to make use of my time. So I thought I'd show you something, which is the Zoom uh, app and website, which uh, you've probably heard of by now. It's just a way we can do interviews uh, a little bit differently, adds a couple of little dimensions to what we can do already. It makes it look a bit better. I've got this camera here filming me, because then that um, also makes it, you know, just an extra dimension rather than just your standard Skype or FaceTime. So I'll show you why uh, Zoom is quite good. I've got a guest here, he's already waiting, which is very kind. Uh, thank you, Tim. Uh, what Zoom uh, does is it has a little built-in recorder. So there's a record button here, which I'm gonna press. Um, you would have obviously told your guests that you're gonna be recording. So I'm now recording. And um, so if I look at my uh, screen here, my laptop, it's an old laptop, so forgive the quality on there, but, um, uh, I'm going to ask Tim a question and uh, and just say, yeah, how's the lockdown going, Tim? Uh, Lewis, it's going absolutely fine. Thank you very much. Yes, welcome to Hampshire on a, a blustery evening this evening. Lockdown for me has involved a lot of cycling, a lot of gardening. My goodness, my sweet peas are looking fine. And I've been listening to a lot of music. If I Can Dream by Elvis Presley. Great LP there. Here's a single that is a bit apt at the moment. If I Could Do The Things I Want To Do by Tom Jones. Homes, but sadly none of us can. And if I get very bored, there's always Winston Churchill and the Second World War. I'm up to volume two. Awesome, Tim. I knew you'd be great at this. Role reversal. Apologise for my presenting. Um, what, what is actually happening with the Zoom's uh, inbuilt recorder is I stopped talking, Tim started speaking. The, the software detects that. When it detects audio, it uses that camera as the source of recording. So you can't control it. But when Tim is speaking, so it's recording me now, if I'm looking into my screen, when Tim starts talking, uh, I'm going to just ask him again, you know, what else, what other music have you been listening to? You'll notice that it starts uh, recording on his uh, screen. So it's going to do that automatically. I can't control it. Go away, Tim. Yeah, one of the things I've been listening to, Lewis, is this box set of Shirley Bassey LPs. There's a lot of good music there to keep me going. She's certainly got my gold finger. <laughs> Cool. He kept it clean enough. I think that was good. Um, so that's great. So it, what it gives you, it gives you, yeah, you've got a camera set up looking at everything. I've put a couple of lights off. Uh, I've got my camera looking at me now. You've seen Tim's camera uh, recording as you would want to for your guest. Um, one other feature you can do is up here, you've got a little thing called gallery view. Uh, you see on my screen, if you point to my, for my camera, I can see two, I can see Tim and myself side by side. What it actually does is I think the recorder now, the Zoom built-in recorder is recording those two. So you could have this, you could record this before or after at the end, just so you don't have to click while you're doing an interview. But you've got Tim nodding, you've got me perhaps into introducing it. You know, you, I could be talking to this camera with sort of something on the background, which is just a bit different. And um, yeah, so you've got sort of three options from the Zoom recorder. You've got my camera, this camera, and the, and the split screen, and you've got another camera. It just gives something a little bit more for the edit when all you might have is an interview during this lockdown mode. So um, I come out of the uh, gallery view, so I'm back to probably recording my camera as I hope. I say it's automatic, but uh, I just want to say thank you to Tim. Lewis, no problem at all. It's been an absolute pleasure. And from my end, it's really nice because I can see you very clearly and I can see me in a little shot in the corner. Good, so the customer's happy. Oh yeah. Brilliant, thank you, Tim. That's Good it. Night. Hopefully that's it, cheers. So when you've stopped recording and you've pressed end meeting, it will automatically go into this convert meeting recording and it will save it on your hard drive as an MP4, which then you can put into Premiere and edit along with all your other footage.